But FC Cincinnati fans have reason to celebrate tonight. Oh, yes, they do. Their team is one step closer to its goal of joining Major League Soccer. Team leaders reached a crucial deal with members of the West End Community Council after a meeting that lasted all day long. Yeah, about nine, ten hours. It was yes. a really long day. Nine on your side's Kristen Swilly joins us live right now from City Hall, in fact, with how the day unfolded and what comes next. Kristen? Yeah, good evening, guys. Negotiations came down to the wire inside City Hall today, but after hours of debate, both sides agree progress was made. We're still working. We're having, a, we're having great discussion. It was a day spent mostly behind closed doors for West End stakeholders and FC Cincinnati. We've had a very impressive uh, couple hours of conversation back and forth. But after nine hours in the official go ahead from the city, the deal is done. The last legislative hurdle separating FCC from an MLS bid gone. We still have a few agreements that uh, have been committed to that just need to be signed. There's some lawyering that need, that's being done, if you will, behind the scenes. We spoke to FC Cincinnati President Jeff Birding shortly after he signed off on the amended community benefits agreement. It's a legally binding commitment that is the foundation of a partnership that's going to be ongoing for decades. Kristen Myers, the attorney representing the West End in negotiations, agrees this is only the beginning. The community did not get everything that it wanted. Um, and there's still a lot of work to be done for this community, but I think that we have uh, found a path forward for, for many of the issues. Now is the time to heal. Now is the time for the community to come back together. The stadium is going to be there. Uh, there are an awful lot of benefits for the residents of the West End, and now is the time to bring all those things together and just move forward. Now, of course, FC Cincinnati still waiting to find out whether they'll actually be able to join Major League Soccer, whether or not they get that bid. In the meantime, if you want to read more about the Community Benefits Agreement, you can head to our website, WCPO.com. Reporting live at City Hall this evening, Kristen Swilly, 9 on your side.